This is Mrs. O'Sullivan, the theater teacher here at Freedom High School, and I'm here to proudly present Anastasia Hasty as our outstanding theater student of the year. Uh, Anastasia, as she says, Anastasia, uh, is an outstanding student for a variety of reasons. Um, but the biggest being that uh, without her, I'm not really sure that this theater program would have moved forward. Uh, several years ago, uh, a group of students came forward begging uh, for the chance to have theater after the theater program was cut. Uh, and uh, I said I would sponsor them. And Anastasia was one of those students who, from the beginning, uh, took charge, and she, uh, she, she, she directed her own play that year. She was a sophomore, and it was just incredible. Uh, she directed Macbeth, which is a difficult, difficult play, and it was a, it was a one act, so it was a short version, but it was still a very difficult thing to do, uh, and she did it. Uh, and that was as a sophomore. And then she just pushed and she said, we, we need this theater program. We need it to happen. And so it happened. Uh, and then the following year, uh, we, we did some, some more plays. And uh, then this year, in particular, uh, she really, really took it, uh, took it off. Uh, and she uh, was the director for uh, our one act of Romeo and Juliet. So yet again, she uh, went with Shakespeare. And not only was she the director, but she was Juliet. And she was outstanding. And she did an outstanding job directing. Uh, and then again, she was in our springtime performance of You Can't Take It With You. And she was just outstanding. She did something that she'd never done before, a different type of character. And she just really went with it and she just shined. Uh, so I know Anastasia Hasty is just going to be an incredible, incredible uh, person in the theater as she moves forward in her life. And I'm super excited, and I'm so proud of her, and I miss her terribly, and I'm very, very happy to give her this award for Outstanding Theater Student of the Year. Thank you.